Just like in the case of the war between Russia and Ukraine, we need immediate ceasefire and then peace in the Gaza conflict. Since the bloody attacks in last October by Hamas, the number of victims has been more than 40,000. Most of them are Palestinian civilians, a lot of women and children. We do not question Israel's right to defend itself. However, the occupation of Gaza and the retaliating um, military action and the genocide cannot be justified with any sort of right to self-defense. They do not um, respect cultural heritage. They demolish, they destroy destroy hospitals and schools. And while the Ukrainian-Russian conflict uh, goes on live in uh, the media in the West, uh, we do not see a fraction of the suffering of Palestinian civilians, even though uh, human rights and the, protect the right to the protection of human life is a right of everyone, regardless of their skin tone, their religion, and their uh, uh, heritage. Now, instead of a two-state uh, solution, Israel is waging a war against the Palestinian people. We call upon the responsible bodies of the EU and the UN to stop the bloodshed and act in the interest of peace. Thank you. Thank you. The next speaker is Ms. Firmenich.